Hello everyone, welcome back to my blog or YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to prepare a delicious oven-baked pork knuckle. Fall apart tender meat on the inside and crispy skin on the outside. That's what makes this German delicacy the ultimate dish to treat your friends with, along with a beer or two of course. It takes a while to prepare, but the cooking process is very simple, so let's get started. I'm working with a really large pork knuckle today, so to reduce the overall cooking time, I'm going to boil it first. To get some flavors in, add a large onion, 3 or 4 garlic cloves, 4 or 5 bay leaves, 2 tablespoons of salt, 1 teaspoon of caraway seeds, a teaspoon of black peppercorns, and 5 allspice corns. Cover the pot and simmer on low for 60 to 90 minutes, depending on the size of the knuckle. Mine took 90 minutes to become tender. Once cooked, transfer the knuckle to a deep baking dish and use a sharp knife to make cuts into the skin. The cuts will also allow the seasonings to get closer to the meat itself and penetrate it deeper and better, which is another positive. Let's prepare a simple marinade now. Just mix 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 1 tablespoon of salt, 1 tablespoon of black pepper and 1 or 2 crushed cloves of garlic. Properly brush the pork knuckle on all sides. This is an important step, so make sure you don't skip any part of the knuckle. Should you run out of marinade, simply prepare a bit more. It takes just a few seconds. We need a few more ingredients added to the baking dish. 3 cloves of garlic first. Just hit them with a knife and cut into larger chunks. 2 medium sized onions come next. Just cut this roughly and add them to the dish. And since this is a German dish, we cannot forget some beer. Dark is my preferred one for this recipe. Let's put the broth we made while boiling the knuckle to a good use as well. Add 2 or 3 ladles. And lastly, drop in 3 stalks of rosemary. Start baking the knuckle at 150 Celsius or 300 Fahrenheit. It will take approximately 2 hours to bake fully. Keep basting the knuckle every 30 minutes, at least, to make sure the meat doesn't dry out. It's also a good idea to flip the knuckle after about an hour, so it bakes nicely from the bottom too. For the final 30 minutes, turn the knuckle skin side up again and increase the baking temperature to 250 Celsius or 475 Fahrenheit to make the skin nice and crisp. Once the skin becomes deep golden brown and lightly charred, we are done. I like to keep the sides very simple for this dish. Fresh bread, horseradish, pickles and some spicy peppers are all you need to enjoy this delicacy. Served on a nice wooden board, this knuckle just looks amazing. Oh, and remember how I mentioned the meat would be fall apart tender? Check this! That's all for today, thanks for watching and see you next time!